Okay, we'll try to mount the Z axis onto this plate. I'll have to adjust this mount, put the stepper motor on, get it lined up. Just putting it on temporarily for now. The next thing to do will be to mount these mounts for the ball screws for the Y axis on, and then mount the ball screws between them. But in order to do that, I need those corner plates that are supposed to go here because I, I don't know the size of them and these plates mount right up against it so I don't know where to position these to mount the ball screws because once you get that mounted then you have to mount the flat bar to the ball screws mounts underneath there so I got to have everything positioned correctly to do that. Uh, I thought I was expecting the those plates in today, along with my spindle motor and inverter, but I did not get them. Well, I finally got the corner plates in to mount on the legs here to help brace it. So I'm going to mount them on the four corners, and then we can uh, start mounting the ball screws for the y-axis.
I finished up mounting the plates on all four corners and went ahead and mounted the mounting bracket onto the ball nut that will mount to the aluminum bar that goes across the bottom to tie the gantry all together. Also mounted the first plate uh, the ball screw mount on this end and getting ready to mount the the other end which will be the drive end so we're going to mount that now I ended up having to make a little wooden wooden tool to insert these nuts in the slot. They'll drop in, but it's hard to get them in position to hold them while you insert the bolt. I had a heck of time on the other end, so I decided to make this little holder so I can slide it in position. Put a little screw on here to guide it so the whole thing will drop in on an angle like that. And I can slide it over and hopefully get the bolt started. Almost need three hands. Now with that screw there holding the holder in there, the thing wants to lean forward. Doesn't want to stay where I want it while I'm trying to raise this up. Well, there's one side done.
All right, we got both ball screws mounted now. We'll have to measure between them on each end to see if they're perfectly parallel, which I hope they are, and they should be because we mounted them against these corner plates, and this frame was good and square to start with, so that should put everything in line. And uh, I'll have to figure out how to mark the aluminum bar to match up with the screw holes that they've got tapped holes they've got in these mounts on each side and uh, somehow mark this aluminum bar and so we'll have to run the, the ball nuts to each end and check it see the distance between the, the screw holes and uh, see if everything's going to line up right 